Hello everybody, welcome to part 63 of Let's Play Dark Souls. Um, as you can see, it's a bit of a change of scenery. Uh, you might be wondering, why are we not fighting Seath the Scaleless? And well, the uh, the answer is, I, um, I already did, um, as you can see here. Uh, unfortunately, last episode's footage went the way of the, um, the depths, where it uh, kind of got corrupted, unfortunately. So... It's a real shame, too, because <clears throat> uh, a lot of work went into that episode uh, to give it the short version. It turns out that the shortcut in the uh, Dukes of Ar Archives, which we spent so much time to actually do, which you guys didn't actually experience the full brunt of thanks to the magic of video editing, um, but thanks to that shortcut, we were not able to head back to the um, where Big Hat Logan's locked up, so therefore I had to go all the way back, fight him, uh, fight Seath to get cursed and then end up in the jail cell. Make my way back down to Big Cat Logan. Um, we had the key on us though already, so that helped a little bit. Saved us a little bit of time. Free Big Hat made our way all the way back to the <laughs> other bonfire. And uh, once we were there, um, I bought all of Big Hat Logan's stuff. So we got a few spells. I guess I'll quickly show you those. Um, basically just crystal versions of some common spells here. And then after buying all, all of his stuff, Big Hat Logan goes crazy. And uh, once you then go on to fight Seat the Scaleless, which um, we did, you can then go back to the first place where you fight Seat the Scaleless. And Big Hat Logan will be in there with uh, no clothes on, except for his hat. And he's going crazy. And you can fight him. <laughs> so that's what we did. We fought him. We got a uh, we got a spell that he did, made the Dragon Breaths. Um, spell that you might have seen there for a moment, which we don't even have enough intelligence to use. <laughs> 50, we're only 40. Um, but yeah, all that is gone, unfortunately. But you know what? <coughs> yeah. It's probably for the best because, um, in all honesty, that it, I was getting very frustrated with everything going on in that whole recording and everything. So, um, not my best work, but here we are. So, unlike last time where I had corrupted footage and I quit for a few months, um, this time we're kind of just going to press forward, just going to accept that uh, some fortunate things happen and there's not much we can do about it. So with that being said, we have all the four souls. We could fight Gwyn and call it a day, but instead we're going to take on the DLC, which is why we're here. So um, if you remember, we're just going to get sucked in by the hand. Manus's hand, you might recognize now. Go. And here we are. Now we can rest at the sanctuary. I mean, the chuary garden. <laughs> and then we get to fight a uh, rather difficult boss, depending on how you're feeling. <laughs> Hopefully this goes well. It's uh, it's the next day, so I'm a little refreshed from um, yesterday's frustrations. Although today is when I experienced the whole corrupted flesh problem, so. That kind of uh, put me back to a not great scene. Oh, okay. And he gets the first hit. Okay, well. <laughs> this was a quick death. Uh, the nice thing is, I probably won't have to do much cutting of uh, <laughs> we're running back to the arena because um, we're right here. So let's try it again. This is one of those bosses, I think, where mid-rolling makes it a lot more difficult. So, in fact, this whole area, like Artorias and everything, mid-rolling just makes it extra challenging. Okay, but once you get the timing down, it's not too Oh, wow, we're already closing. <laughs> yeah, this boss really does not give you much time to heal either. Stun lock though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I think the key is just to never get hurt. So, therefore, I'll never be stressed about needing to get healing. And <laughs> therefore, oh, we'll be well. But, um, that kind of a situation, I might just switch to light rolling anyway, just to make my life a little easier. 
because I really break it down, right? I'm not light rolling because I'm wearing armor, and armor is therefore supposed to be protecting me, which it's <laughs> not doing a very good job of. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna light roll. This is this is not gonna go well. <laughs> Mid rolling. I can tell you that right now. I don't remember if I did that last time, but I'm just gonna say it right now. Um, I think this whole area is gonna be just a lot of um, a lot of light rolling. To be honest, is that light enough? I don't think so. Um, I'll take the shield off. I think that'll do. All right, yeah. So we'll pretend I'm wearing my armor underneath the robe here. <laughs> like that. I don't know if it's going to be worth for the flippy ring. I think I'm going to keep the wolf ring on. Or rather, oh, how about we put the wolf ring on? <laughs> yeah, I had, I had that on because I'm uh, making my way to the portal. You have to slug through some mortal water. Okay, here we go. Now I'm lightweight. Now he can't do anything. I also don't like this boss because it's a lot of like, it looks like he's going to attack, but then like, it just gets drawn out for a long time before he actually does. Which, if you're jumpy, you might end up rolling too early. Okay. There we go. And you got me. Okay, there we go. Nice. Healing. Get the tail. We already have. I think we had his whip last time. This is uh, what you get for cutting his tail off. This is really just his tail as a whip. This is a good one to get some hits in. Oh, <laughs> okay, that was kind of greedy. I admit. Kind of on me there. It's a good thing we have so much Estus. That's from the uh, Duke's archives there. Nope. That again. This time we'll be smart. Like a full attack attack. Good stagger. And, well, I'm already poisoned, so. <laughs> That's the disadvantage of light rolling. Pretty sure we survived that with our armor on. Oh man, I think this. I was hoping to bang out this whole DLC in one day, but uh, that's not looking like it's going to be the case. <laughs> this whole episode might be devoted to this guardian for all we know. Unless I can get him this time. If I can get him this time, be in good shape. Oh, okay, great start. And I'm just gonna heal there. Oh, I think he shot that into the ground. Oh, come on. Troubled the first time I fought him. I honestly don't even remember <laughs> much of that fight. Oh boy. Well, I hope you guys are having fun <laughs> watching me just get smashed like this. Just making all my souls as well at this point. Oh, I 
had enough stamina, so <laughs> there was not going to be an attack there. Doing a great job of dodging all my attacks. I'm literally out of stamina. Okay, okay, it's fine. Man, this is not going well at all. It's one of those bosses where just, he's got some really weird patterns, but just all of a sudden, like, you'll get the timings down, it'll click, and then I think it just goes very smoothly all of a sudden. Like, we're learning, like, when he does that little one-two combo, you don't want to roll back, you got to sort of roll to the left, I think. Let's try again. And it'll just come out with a new attack like that. Let's not get poisoned this time. I still can't get the timing down on that. There we go. for his tail, which is just getting me killed. Ooh, all right, that's the big combo, yeah. It's fine, it's fine. Taking the time to learn his attacks. Be a case where you want to lock on sometimes, but then unlock at other times. Because when he flies in the air, you just can't tell what the heck's going on. <laughs> the next thing you know, you're dead. and then he just like gets it out of the way right at the last second. Tail, just go right by the button. Oh, he got me there, but then he followed it up with the combo. Okay, that's interesting. I always thought that that attack hurts you, but it actually almost stuns you. That's no, not too bad.
two. Got the guardian tail again. Just now we don't have to worry about him swinging it. There we go. All right, cool. So it's kind of like I said, guys. Um, it's just really rough at first, but then once you get most of the patterns down, it's not so bad. Guardian Soul. And the, I don't know what can we make with the Guardian Soul. I don't know I think about it. Oh, who knows? Uh, where do we go? I think this way. So yeah, I think uh, we'll mix it up. I'll, I'll light roll for this um, for this playthrough of the DLC. Because why not? It's next, because actually, I just realized we're going to have the Artorias sword throughout the actual, uh, for the most of this year. <laughs> Whereas last time, since we needed that Sif cutscene, we, uh, held off on that. Now, last time there was a lot of lore to this place, right? A lot of lore. Which we're going to sort of, um, skip over. We're going to not worry about talking to people. I definitely got to Kindle, by the way, because... I just foresee using up a lot of us. This is like, it's quite a gauntlet to get through. Like I said, we have so much humanity. And with online services down, we don't have much else use for it. Let's first our hollowing. Minty restored. I'm gonna do a bunch of kindling here. Let's see, I might uh, cut the episode at this point, right? We'll start fresh. We'll. Uh, Plenty of time to take our time. I don't want to feel rushed running through the same time because I'm not going to have to be running around trying to grab kind of kindling. Oh, I must have already kindled this. I forget that kindling saves between New Game Plus. Uh, definitely don't have enough to level up. Let's see here. Uh, tell you what, I'll make one attempt at just running through. We'll see how long that takes. I'm not going to talk to the mushroom lady. I'm not going to do any of that. I literally just want to activate the shortcut. So that way we can uh, fight Artorias. A little bit stress-free. So I'm gonna try to just run past most of the gardeners as well. Uh, one of the nice effects of our Artorias sword, which I mentioned, is that you get a bonus damage versus Abyss. But I'm not sure if these uh, stone guardians and the planter guys count as Abyss monsters. They might just sort of be Ulysseal magic. Um, I kind of hit hard. <laughs> Let's see if I remember where to go here. I think we go this way. Oh no. Um. Oh, oh, oh. So that was, of course, the uh, Calamite Dragon. It's going to be fun fighting him, I get a bit. Should I fight him with the Calamity Ring on? <laughs> that would just be hilarious, wouldn't it? Because uh, when I say I want to do all the bosses in a more challenging way, um, when it comes to Calamine, I'm definitely not going to try to fight him before talking to Go. That is, like, asking for trouble. Um, I don't even... I, I've heard it's technically possible if you stand in a spot where you can avoid his fire. But, uh, yeah, I ain't, I ain't messing with that. Okay, uh, so we made great progress already. We're very close to Artorias. I think. Yeah, we wanna go that way. Oh no! Let's get healing. Um. Oh, I forget if this is a dead end, but I don't think it is. Yep, Let's see if we can go here. He better not fall on me. 
Oh, wow. All right. Yeah, we're already here. <laughs> so, we actually want to go that way, I believe. Since we, there is a shortcut, so that way you don't have to run this far every time. Um, do I even want to talk to this guy? Hmm. Snatched? Yeah, 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 snatched. Yeah. We mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, does he have anything I want? Not really. Like maybe green blossoms, but so long. I don't really use those. Probably should use them more often. I feel like it'd be a big help. Definitely be a big help, in fact. Especially in that last fight. Where our biggest issue was a lack of Estus. <laughs> I mean, stamina. Uh, we have plenty of Estus. Uh, where am I? So, uh, ac having activated that, I think we're mostly good. I, just, I feel like there's another bonfire, though. But I could be wrong. Somewhere around here is essentially the start. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so it is that bonfire then. So in that case, let's just fight Artorius. Why not? We got some time. Depending on how well this goes, we might be able to squeeze two bosses into the episode. It's always a fun time. Was it this one? Yeah. Alright, we're gonna free Artorius with his own sword. It's very poetic if you ask me. Uh, send the elevator back up just in case this doesn't go too smoothly. Got plenty of Estus. I think this fight can be a bit of an endurance, so having a lot of Estus is very helpful. But yeah, without any further ado, let's uh, get to it. I'll watch a cutscene, of course, because it's a very, very cool one. So cool. Alright, let's put him down. Oh. I do not remember many of his patterns off the top of my head, so I should probably go a little defensive at first. I know he'll do this like three or four times. There's sludge in my face. That's dangerous is that he can follow up a lot of his attacks a lot more quickly than you might think. Oop. Oh. Yeah, see what I mean about endurance with this. this. Should be getting bonus damage. Like, there's definitely some abyss on him. <laughs> it does not feel like it, does it? Oh my god. Oh, no. Yep. Let's try locking on. And then we'll lock off right away, because that just makes me nauseous when <laughs> he's in here too much. Uh, I think we want to not be near him when he does that. So, chaos. Oh yeah, I don't know if we're ever going to get to stagger him. Oh, yeah. I had a feeling that would be the case. <laughs> that, that, uh, that sliding stab he does, you really got to sidestep it. Uh, it's fine. I did not think we were going to get him on the first try. <laughs> Yeah, we got him almost halfway. That's a little better than I thought. So let's uh, try it again. I'll, I'll cut back and meet you there. Alrighty, take two.
always got to look out for those kind of attacks where there's a big opening for you afterwards. Oh. Raiden blows here. Commentary is a bit uh, <laughs> lacking, by the way, but um, this is a fight that really gets a lot of focus. I always think I can dodge it at the end there. That is just his anti Estes attack. <laughs> oh. Let's find a good opportunity to heal here. No! Okay, I knew I was dead there. <laughs> oh. Oh, man, this episode is gonna have some awkward timing. I feel like we gotta finish off Artorias this episode, but uh. Sorry, what? I don't usually do this, but I think I'm going to cut to the actual successful attempt here so it doesn't drag on too long. So I will see you guys there. Okay, this better be the one because um, i got time for one more attempt here before i got to pull out to do some stuff, stuff in the gym. So maybe try being a little more aggressive than usual. Oh. <laughs> I guess if I mean a swing them. Oh, I hate that attack so much. It just comes out so quickly, and that is literally the reason why I play so defensively with him, because you play aggressively, and he'll just whip that out and kill you instantly.
for that. If I followed up, I'd be dead. Explosion. Stop. Feel like I'm in a good flow right now. Okay, okay, it's not jinx myself. <laughs> like what is fourth <laughs> stage up now so this will be his fourth phase but third power up Less of those. Double little by accident there.
Stay patient, stay patient. And there it is. Oh my god. Okay. Woo! <laughs> G and G are curious. Oh man, yeah, I was <laughs> I was thinking about finishing him with a strong attack like I usually do for bosses, but I think that would have been pretty greedy. How are you be able to land that on him? But we did it. Got 100,000 souls for our effort and the soul of Artorius as well. So last time I believe we gave that to uh, Kiernan, who's going to show up um, once we rest up the bonfire, I think. So let's go do that. But yeah, that fight there <laughs> made me realize why I love the game so much. It's like, you know, you get so frustrated. The boss is like driving you crazy. It's so difficult and hard, but then you, know, you focus, start to laser focus in on the patterns, get into a good flow state. And then when you actually do prevail, uh, the satisfaction is just so good. So let's uh, let's just level up here and then call it an episode. So it's probably going to be a pretty long episode at this point because um, that, that fight went on for quite some time. I had to really play patiently there. <laughs> really can't get too aggressive with him. But either way, guys, here we are. We got the Ulusil Township ahead of us. Um, <laughs> I already kindled it up to 20 because yeah, this is quite an endurance place. Or a bit of a gauntlet, rather, is the term. We do have to pick up a few key items. Um, kind of only just one, though, just the uh, key to get and go. Oh, I never remember his name. But <laughs> either way, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you had a good time. I did back into the flow. And I will see you all next time. Bye bye.